Well, there is concern tonight throughout Northern Virginia over a health alert. Health officials warn at least one person has been exposed to the measles. And on top of that, health officials believe this person in question has been to at least a dozen places where he or she may have exposed others. The alert affects people living or working in Fairfax and Loudoun counties. Tom Rousey is live at Chantilly with more on who has reason to be worried about this. Tom. Allison, we've talked to a number of folks concerned about this because that person with the measles did go to so many places. One of them is a Harris Teeter in this shopping center behind me. Most of the places the person went to, they were along Route 50 here near the border of Fairfax and Loudoun counties. That means a lot of people were potentially exposed. With kids, you know, you got to worry, especially you know because they'll spread like that. Randy Hadadine says he was warned by his daughter's daycare today about the possible measles exposure. His older daughter, Noor, has been vaccinated, but 17 month old Zen has not. That's about to change, however. We're taking care of it. So that's why we went ahead and, uh, and got an appointment right away. So she, tomorrow morning, she'll get the shot. If you were not vaccinated, then you are susceptible to getting infected. And that's why we want people to be on the lookout. Dr. David Goodfriend is director of the Loudoun County Health Department. He says the person with the measles got it in a foreign country. The large majority of people who do get it have foreign travel and the large majority were not vaccinated. He says stage one of the measles involves high fever, a runny nose and a cough. Stage two involves a rash over the entire body. Health officials say between April 23rd and May 1st, the person with measles went to a number of places in Fairfax and Loudoun counties, most in either Chantilly or South Riding, everywhere from this medical center to a CVS to this Target where we talked with shoppers tonight. I got alarmed because it's so close. Now, the measles vaccination is to help prevent you getting the measles in the future. So anyone who knows anyone who may have been exposed, who hasn't been vaccinated, they need to watch out for the symptoms, health officials say. They say if you have any concerns, you or someone you love might potentially be getting those symptoms, to call a doctor immediately. Live tonight in Loudoun County in Chantilly, I'm Tom Rousey, ABC 7 News. All right, that's good advice, Tom. And if you'd like a complete list of the public places where the person with measles visited, you can just check our website, WJLA.com.